At the beginning of February 2023, I was diagnosed with depression. I picked up a prescription called Serotaline. These are tablets for people suffering from anxiety and depression. I started taking these tablets four days in a row and they made me stay up all night and I was not enjoying them. I was meant to feel happy, they was making me feel worse, they was making me not sleep, they was making me go insane. At this time I was also making music so I was in a studio a lot and I had a music manager at this time and he was like what's going on with you because he knew that I wasn't okay and I told him about me taking serotonin, the, the, the tablets to make me feel better. That right there, he made me realise like how deep I've gone down like he was like whoa he made me realise everything from that day there. I took these serotonin tablets and I threw them in a bin. I said, I'm going to make a change. I didn't know how, but I was going to do it. From there, I started to focus. And a few months later, I took this picture of my day one transformation video. And from that day is when I started my monk mode. If you guys have watched my insane 90 day transformation, you can see I achieve results in such a short amount of time. This is because I've installed many things in this video I'm going to tell you to help me work a lot more than someone who wouldn't do it would. So I've installed habits and the things that you're going to learn in this video, it's going to get you in the gym even more. So I wouldn't have achieved my physique in such a short amount of time if I didn't put strict rules and discipline into place. This is the monk mode guys, the monk mode made me work so hard on my body, train my body every single day with no remorse, go all in because I've put stuff into place. I would not be able to get that body that fast if I was just to work out normally. You gotta train your mind guys, you have to train your mind. You don't just have to think about this as in working out. This can be if you, if you wanna implement it on your business, if you wanna focus on your business more. Putting things into place I'm going to tell you in this video will change your life dramatically. But I've been talking about monk mode a lot but I haven't really explained it. I've seen a lot of people say, what is monk mode? What What is going on? Like Monk mode is a time where you detach yourself from everything. Everything in your life. You, you're not there right now. You're fully focused on yourself. If you go out partying on the weekends, you ain't doing that no more. If you're having sex every day, you ain't doing that no more. If you smoke weed every day, you ain't doing that no more. This is literally a full 90 days. I say 90 days, guys, because that's what I have done. I'm, I kind of say I'm still in monk mode right now. I don't even want to leave it. I can go out and enjoy myself. I can go clubbing. I can meet girls. I can smoke weed. I can go drink alcohol. I can do this. I can watch. Listen, I've chose to stay like this because I, li I actually like it. It helps. Monk mode is literally just all about self-improvement, self-development. I'm going to tell you guys how I've done this, how much i changed because if you guys know me before, you guys see I've changed a lot. I think just adding these into place is gonna make you you'll see the difference you will not realize straight away but start to acknowledge it but guys let me get into the video make sure you like and subscribe and feel free to check out my course sign up if you want to get your abs first this is all about everything i explain here is in the course as well there's more details of workouts and nutrition plans make sure you check out my course if you want to get abs fast perfectly lean build we can do this guys I love training people, so make sure you sign up. If you have a big belly, I'm going to crack down on you guys. I actually love it. I actually come see. Uh, it's actually fun, guys. Listen, let's get into the video. So the first thing when you enter monk mode is you need to cut out any sort of distractions such as Netflix, TV shows, TikTok. TikTok is very, very powerful. Very powerful. The app is insane. The app will keep you up all night. It lo Listen, it will lock you in. Think about this right now. Why would they create that app to keep you, to keep you low? They want to keep you, they want to keep you on your phones all day. I literally, I used to watch TikTok and I would be on TikTok all night. I would scroll through, it would, it would be 10, it would be 10, 7 p.m. Scrolling through TikTok, just chilling. Comes up to like 1 a.m. Time goes by so fast, you're like, you don't even realise tell you this right now i haven't watched a movie or a tv show since like april since i started my transformation i haven't watched 
any movies. I was watching movies with my dad because that's what that's what I liked. We, my dad used to watch loads of movies. Was watching Game of Thrones, and then I used to work out to watching Game of Thrones is the last entertainment I ever watched, guys. Like Game of Thrones was the last thing I ever watched. I used to watch it while hitting the exercise cycle. First couple weeks of my transformation, guys, it was it was fun. I just used to watch and burn calories, watch and burn calories. But no, listen, guys, when you stop watching, it's called TV programs for a reason. You're programming your brain. You're basically gonna end up like what you're watching. You know what I mean? It's, it's mad. Like, if I show you my YouTube recommendation right now, look at this. Look, look at everything there. I don't even watch. I try not even I try not even to watch YouTube every day but when I do look what I'm watching guys look at the content right there you need to fill your mind with stuff that's going to benefit you TV programs watching Netflix for two hours that's minus two hours of your time you could be doing anything with that time you can be working out you could be finding ways to make more money so listen guys when you start this monk mode guide hopefully you guys start right now cut out Netflix cut out TV programs Delete TikTok, delete Instagram, delete the whole of social media. Maybe not YouTube though. YouTube is something you can use as education. And like I was saying, guys, look at my YouTube, it's all education. I'm learning, I'm trying to improve every day. I'm not watching something to laugh, I'm watching something to learn. Do you understand what I'm saying? Another thing I stopped in monk mode was porn. I did not watch porn anymore. Like I stopped that completely. I was watching porn all the time. You know what I mean? Just see look guys a lot of this is about time it's about time you're watching netflix you're two hours there after you watch netflix you're about to sleep quit fat quit porn that's like 10 minutes or something energy as well your energy Psh. i don't know if you guys can manage to stop sex but if you want to go extreme in this monk mode no fat no sex for 90 days you will come out like a new man if you have the power to control your hormones you have the power to control anything it's insane guys i know how hard it is just to like not beat your meat because you can be beating that every day and you just stop it's gonna feel weird it's gonna feel like you're missing something you're gonna be like you know what? i'm missing something today what can i do you know i'm bored the hormones might hit you might just get hard you might get pricked guys you gotta control that stuff you gotta think when you're getting hard yeah you gotta think like uh i got work on monday what can i do in work what can i do in work that's going to make my boss like me. Start thinking about things that are not sexual. You, you'll, you'll go down. You get rid of that. You get rid of that thought. And you'll be chill. Guys, no fat. It's actually going to change your life dramatically. You're going to start focusing on yourself way more. And just stop focusing on distractions. And you're going to see girls in a different type of way. You're, got, you're not just going to see girls as a. Just to have sex with you. You'll start talking to girls like about. You'll start talking to girls like you're talking to anybody. You know what I mean? Some of you guys might just talk to girls because you just want to have sex. You may try add that little, you know what I mean? Just like entertainment there, just conversation. But at the end of the day, you want to have sex. You want you want to get in their pants. So when you're stopping fat guys, you'll start talking to girls like actually about life. Like it's 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 crazy, guys. No fat, no sex. Literally, full monk mode. If you want to change, this is insane, guys. I'm giving you guys the source right now. I'm giving you guys the source. Make sure you like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? I've I've. If I can do this, you can do this as well. This one is something I really wish I did when I was younger, which is reading. While I was in monk mode, guys, I read every single day. I think I read ten pages a day. Then I started doing 20 pages a day. If you can do 100 pages a day, that's like a book a week. I know some experienced guys can do that. You know what I'm saying? I, listen, guys, I'll actually tell you right now, I have dyslexia. So some stuff is hard to figure out. Like it's, but, but reading actually helped me so much with this. Like I've tried to improve my vocabulary. I've tried to, it's, reading is like a gold mine. You know what I'm saying? You're digging for gold. You're digging for information. It's insane. If you want to know something that, I don't know, like, let's say you want to learn about finance or a specific skill like marketing. You can buy a course online or on YouTube. But if you get a book, if you get a book, there's a lot more information in there because there's loads of pages. There will be a lot of key info there. 
So this is why books is very important, guys. It'll help you in your mind. It'll help you speak better. It'll help you understand life more and have a clear goal. It will also give you more ideas. If you don't know what industry you want to be in or you don't know what you really want to do with your life, it will make sure you have that clear idea. You'll find, just read, guys. What I did was I went down to my local library and I just went straight to the psychology section and the mind section and picked up like 10 books, walked out, started reading from there but it's very hard at first guys i can't lie you have to you have to add a little schedule i'm going to tell you guys about a morning routine my morning routine you guys are going to want to use this morning routine go to your library right now go on amazon order some books research some books what books you want to read obviously i like self-improvement books that i want to learn or your craft if it's sales get some sales books if it's i don't know designing if it's um marketing if it's um learn taxes if it's trading if it's learn if you learn your niche get the book of your niche just get some books and read and see you know what i'm saying instead of watching netflix you're reading you know what i'm saying buy some books buy some books reading will also bring your stress levels down so if you're stressing about a lot of things taking that time to just read calm you down sometimes i like to read till my eyes is closing sitting down and reading a book having that patience with yourself to actually try something will actually help you when you want to try other things like um like a new skill you're gonna um go into that skill more focused you're gonna conquer that skill better than the person not reading or not in this monk mode the, the, the degenerate man if he does the same skill as you and he's doing all of this bullshit and you're focusing on this self improvement you're in monk mode you're gonna conquer you're going to beat this guy while he's watching Netflix, you're working out. While he's meeting girls, you're reading. While he's doing this, you're sending emails, you're editing, you're making sales, you're... Listen, you will outcompete loads of people when you're in monk mode. You will outcompete them because you're not doing things that they're doing. You're going to win against a lot of people. Just remember this. You're going to conquer. You're going to pass through. You're going to get ahead. You're going to go straight in. The guys, them guys there are going down. You're going up. Sometimes when I see guys that are drinking or doing something and I'm doing something else, I know that I'm, I'm doing I'm doing a better thing. I know I'm winning. Sometimes when I see someone drinking or smoking or going out, I know that I'm winning because I'm not doing that. I know I have more time. I just, he, he's, he just lost out on some time. That time could have been a big deal. Gap right there could have been a $20 million deal. Every minute, every second counts. Of course, guys, you guys will know this. No drugs, no smoking cigarettes, no vaping. I swear, so many people vape is insane. Don't don't think you're watching this and saying, oh, look at this guy, bro. I used to vape every day, bro. You know what I mean? Like, everything I've been through at all, bro. I've been through everything. Do you know what I mean? I've been through this, that, that, and that. So I know how it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm literally, guys, you can change, bro. You can actually fucking change. Stop playing with your life, literally. Like, you can have fun right now, but then when you're like 20, 30, you're going to be doing the same shit, bro. You know what I mean? Let's focus right now as young men. And by the time we're over 20, you can relax. We can retire early. Why are you going to retire at 65 when your skin is all old? Let's retire young. Why we're looking fresh and healthy. But yeah, guys, you guys already know. No drugs or anything. Let's cut that out right now. Waste of money. Also, waste is playing with your brain. Do you know what I mean? You're going to focus less. Let's cut that out. You already know that you have to cut this out if you're watching this right now. You cannot do that. The ways I implemented to cut alcohol, weed and all these things out was... I say weed was a diff- weed is a different story. Let's just talk about vapes first. Vapes was the money. I didn't really need it. I was smoking cigarettes. Nah, smoking cigarettes, that was the money. And it was just nasty, guys. And I was smoking cigarettes. I would smoke. And there would be ash everywhere in my room. And sometimes there would be holes in my bed. Because from the cigarette, the, the bud is strong. And it's not like weed, so the bud is thick and strong. So it can drop out and burn through furniture. Burn through furniture. I was ruining my, my mum's furniture. Do you know what I mean? It was that serious. So I had to quit that. Just money and um, 
it was a bit it was a bit uh trampy the way i was doing it was trampy to cut that out alcohol i quit alcohol because i was aggressive i was aggressive very aggressive guy and uh just going not good shouting at people short temper but i was drunk it was fun but like you know when you're them drunk people they'll be like yeah mate yeah they'll start going insane bro i was like that drunk i was i was if uh, some of my old friends i used to chill with they would know that that, that drunk when i when when max was drunk you don't want to be around him you don't want to be around him when it came to weed quitting weed was a bit different because um that stuff there i used to use weed as a little treat for myself like after i recorded a video when i was younger go out and smoke a z that was my achievement every time i would not smoke a z if i didn't record sometimes i would just wake and bake as well loads of times but it's every day definitely every day smoking that weed it was fun at first when i smoked weed i was like 15 doing my gcse's year 11 i said i said let me just smoke let me just smoke it and see how it was I, mean, I was just I was, I was at a little motive I was like let me smoke it and see how it was I went into school the next day still feeling high bruv smoking weed was fun for the first year when it got to like um started getting older like when I was like 16 17 smoking weed was bad like I had I don't know what it was I don't think I was built for it guys I don't think I was actually listen I don't know if you guys get this as well and you smoke weed but before I rolled up a Z each time, I would have a drop in my heart. It would go like, it was like something's pulling me down. Like, I don't know what it was. It's, it's actually mad. It was pulling me down, thinking like, I'm better than this. It's like I'm saying, someone's saying like, you're better than this. The weight, it hurts. If I carried on building the Z, finishing it off, why I'm, that feeling of my heart being pulled down, I smoked the Z while I'm high, the feeling's even worse, bro. I'm like, fuck, I'm all fried and I'm feeling like shit now. Why did I just smoke that? I'm, I'm high right now and I'm like, oh, I regret this so much. Why did I smoke this? Let me actually try and enjoy this suit instead. Let me just try to watch something to have some fun. Let me try to eat something. Do you know what I mean? Listen, it's like torturing yourself, bro. Torturing yourself. It's fun. It was fun at first. It's fun at first. I know it's not always fun. Like I don't know. That was that was my experience. Like something just made me not want to do it no more. I just had that feeling like I thought I was better than that. I just had that feeling knowing I'm better than that. And weed is a mad thing. I don't know if it was harder to, for me. I think it was probably harder to quit weed than alcohol because um, every everyone smoked weed like it was normally normal. I've seen a lot of people say, "How how how did you stop?" weed and alcohol you need to set a goal for yourself whether it's you want to get um bigger body whether it's when you want to expand in your business you want to get 10k 100k 50k in your bank set that goal say how this will lead on to another thing i'm going to talk about in monk mode is journaling journaling you need to go grab a journal right now you need to go grab a grab a book you're going to write in every day you're going to write you all your goals you're gonna read some books take some notes you're gonna watch some videos take some notes and you're gonna expand you're gonna every day you i want you to write in this journal and how how are you gonna do this you write your goals down say how all right this is my goals for 2024 or my goals for this year it's my goals for a couple months expand expand how are you gonna do it how what do you need to stop i don't want you to check these goals every day start ticking them off you don't even need to tick them off just seeing them there and just doing it another thing right now i want you guys to write 10 goals right now get out your notepad and write 10 goals that you want to achieve are you guys writing it with all these goals right now i want you to cross out i want you to cross out seven of them with all of these goals i want you to pick the top three the top three goals that you want to achieve the most important ones i want you to cross out all the other seven and pick the top three goals now with these three these are your main goals these are the goals you need to achieve every single day i want you to look at these goals and see how how am i going to get them every single day you need to think how how am i going to get this every day right i'm going to do this i'm going to do this i'm going to do this get them goals right there whether it's i'm quitting we today or whether it's i want to make a hundred grand this year or whether it's you know what i mean like it's gonna help it's gonna stay in your mind 
what's in your mind, you're going to, you're going to achieve it, bro. You're going to chase it. You're what's in your mind. It's in your mind. It's like, um, what's the word? It's, um, manifestation. You're seeing these goals every day. You're manifesting your mind. You will achieve these goals. So guys, journaling every day, writing your goals, not even just goals, everything in life. You know what I mean? You'll figure it out. You start watching, start doing a lot, self-improvement, hopping on it heavy, heavy. Start doing it. Morning routine. You need to implement a morning routine while you're in monk mode. I'm going to give you guys my morning routine I did every single day throughout my 90 day transformation. I woke up, I set my alarm for around 5.30 because I had work. I was working the whole 90, I tell you guys the whole 90 day transformation, I was working full time. Literally, I want to see you guys saying, oh, I've got work, I'm busy. If I did it, you can do it. You know what I mean? You just got to want it. You guys have to want it. So guys, for my morning routine, this can be at any time. It should only take one hour. Nah, two hours. One hour to two hours. Wake up at your preferred time, mainly early, 8.30 to 5.35. As soon as you wake up, before, after, maybe you go toilet, before you do anything, before you eat, before you check your phone, I want you to meditate for 10 minutes. So get your headphones, download this app called Meditio, put on your headphones, meditate. After you meditate for 10 minutes, go make your coffee or whatever. You're going to go get your book and you're going to read for one hour. 30 minutes at first if, if you're struggling to read because reading, meditation is going to help with your reading as well. Because when you're focusing on the breath, like I said in my other video, trans how I transform my mind, watch that video if you haven't seen it already. But when you meditate, you're focusing on your breath. And then when you're focusing on your breath, not thinking about anything else, it lets you gain focus in your everyday life and activities. This is because you think about laws of when you're meditating, you think you have a lot of thoughts when you're meditating. Just like normally right now, you're thinking about a lot of things. And when you have the power to get rid of those thoughts and focus on nothing but the breath, you have a thought back on the breath. You have another thought and back on the breath. You see, when you're doing that, focusing on the breath, that right there is power that is laser focus you wouldn't even realize but that is laser focus start doing things you start focusing more you're like why am i focusing more it's the meditation that's why it's serious guys this is why a lot of rich people do it a lot of successful people meditate meditation will help you read because like i say you're focused on reading from meditation then you can bump it up do 30 minutes bump it up to an hour by the time you're you're flying through books you're gaining some new knowledge you're going in so that's the first so that's meditating for 10 minutes reading a book for 30 minutes to one hour and then after you're going to want to do the ab workouts these ab workouts are designed they don't just get the abs the ab workouts of course so they target the core area they train that muscle but they also train the arms you know what i'm saying they're going to train the arms the abs the back these ab workouts are powerful very very effective ab workouts they also burn a lot of calories as well i remember i tell you guys in my 90 day transformation i never had an apple watch once i never had an apple watch i never tracked my calories imagine that guys i was fat i was losing weight i never tracked my calories do you know why because i was doing the ab workouts and i was burning calories on the treadmill and i was eating right and doing a load of workouts i didn't even i knew I just I just had the feeling I was like, let me just go all in, research, and see what's going. Let's just see how it turns out. Now look, I ended up burning calories every day. You know what I mean? Serious. It's very hard, but all the work you're gonna do it. But that's the morning routine, guys. Meditating, reading, and working out. Guys, I have an ab workout on my channel already. You can start doing this one. But for more ab workouts, I think I have another four or five on my course. Start doing those as well. Even not, don't even have to do the ab workout. You can just go straight to the gym from there. After you finish reading, straight gym. After you finish that gym, you have the whole day to yourself to focus on your business or anything. You know when you go gym early or you're working out early. After that, 
it feels very good because you've conquered the main thing you've conquered working out now the rest of the day will flow sometimes i, I feel like that sometimes you get the gym done and the, the rest of the day is just good you can do everything else you have the I don't know, you have the confidence to do everything else smoothly in monk mode. I want you guys to be going gym every single day. Every single day, get into that gym. Go in. That's just going to help you focus, literally. No going out, straight gym. This is all focusing yourself, guys. You're trying. Monk mode is to improve your life. If you follow everything I've, I've, I've been saying in this video, you're going to improve dramatically. You're going to increase everything. It's going to go up from there start focusing more on yourself your businesses your family life your money do you know what i mean your health everything you know what i mean everything everything monk mode is serious i don't even want to leave it now like i like it so much like um i don't even want to lose focus guys i just want to keep going yeah man monk mode is still in it now literally i'm still in it it's been like months guys i enjoy it i enjoy it i love it but guys, be sure if you want more info. If you guys want me to make more videos like this, you know, maybe um, more about nutrition or how I lost fat and built muscle at the same time. So me guys know, make sure you like and subscribe. Check out my course. My course has all the all the source. So you guys want to get if you want to get your body up, train with me. Sign up to my course. Three months, every day taking a picture. You're gonna get the results I did. I'm gonna make sure of that. Another thing while you're in monk mode can't lie guys i was in monk mode for a while and um i kind of quit this a bit late like like a like a couple weeks in i stopped listening to drill music because i was using drill music to work out and it was nice i was working out on a treadmill or at the gym and i would have this drill music on and i would go in i'll be going in yeah man it was giving me more energy and stuff and um i cut that out Guys say, why did I cut it out? Because I don't want to listen to violence and stuff. I don't want to listen to guys stabbing each other. Also, it's not just about that. Your mind, you want to be positive. You know, you got to focus in this life. When you want to, young entrepreneurs, you got to be head of the game. You're up against. When you think about this right now, you're watching Andrew Tate. You're watching all these guys, self-improvement guys. And that's who you're up against once you get onto this. You're up against those guys right there. How? How are you going to beat them? How? You know what I'm saying? Like with me, if you want to beat me, you got to get them abs faster than I did in 90 days. And it's got to be legit though. You know what I mean? I'm training some of my students. They'll probably do it better than me because I, because in my transformation, guys, I've gained stuff along the way. So by the time I finished, I knew everything. So if you're starting my course i'm gonna do my whole knowledge onto you so it's insane guys let's get to work man let's start your monk mode tomorrow start cutting out all the distractions start focusing researching fully focus on yourself no going out no girls also this one helped me a lot saving time was 10 minute showers guys i started timing my shower times so 10 minutes 10 minutes i'll set a timer and then I would have to finish in that 10 minutes. So the alarm went off. But I was finishing off. I would, oh, I hate, I hated that feeling. Just quick 10 minute showers is also a lot easier. You know what I'm saying? You can just before work shower, go, shower, go, shower. 10 minutes, guys. Wash hair, teeth, everything. Not just showers, teeth, everything. Start doing this. 10 minute showers. You're going to save a lot more time. But guys, you have to take action. You cannot watch this video and not do anything. You need to take action right now. You watching this whole video is going to be for nothing. You know what I'm saying? I probably just wasted your time if you're not going to do anything. So make sure you take action right now. But guys, thank you for watching. It's Max Turner. I'm out. I'll speak to you guys again, hopefully. Thank you for watching. If you guys want me to make more videos, just let me know. I'll see you guys in the next one. Like and subscribe. Join PLB Fitness. This is a new generation of young men. Let's get it.